Strobe Arm D. So IR is the Walmart of procedures. So in one place, you kind of get a variety of things that you need and you get it at the best price, the lowest price possible. So yeah, IR is the Walmart of procedures. Um, we don't get to pick and choose, you know? A lot of people want to sort of pick and choose. They want to do vascular cases, right? They even say, if you go online, sometimes see people say, I'm not an interventional radiologist, I'm a vascular interventional radiologist. They want to tell the world that they focus on arteries and veins. And some people just want to work on arteries and veins. And definitely if you're a vascular surgeon, you'll probably be working in arteries and veins. IR, we don't get to make that choice. Again, we, we have to be like Walmart. We have to have it all. We work in arteries, we work in veins, we work in the biliary system, we work in the kidney system, the, the collecting system. Uh, we work outside of systems, we do biopsies where we have to create our own paths. Um, we do gastrostomy, right? Basically IR, you have to do everything possible. Um, you have to be able to do anything possible. You have to do an LP at times. There are times when no one else can do an LP and you're available and darn it, you're doing an LP. Uh, you have to provide everything. And, you know, do you provide it at a better cost? Well, it's hard to do a cost-benefit analysis. It really is. Um, there's ways that you can uh, set up the IR billing that it looks like IR is a money loser. Um, but I, I really don't think that it is. I think, you know, pound for pound, an IR physician can create more physician work RVUs in a shorter period of time than any other service, uh, surgical service. Um, I think it is cheaper in a sense for our patients to come down. Take for example a G-tube, right? You do a G-tube with a surgeon, uh, you got OR time, it might be like one or two hours. You need an anesthesiologist to put the patient out. Um, in my mind, that's expensive, right? You're talking about the OR, you're talking about two physicians worth of time. Uh, contrast that to an IRG tube. Patient comes down, you slip a nasogastric tube in, it takes about five minutes, and then 15 minutes later, they have a brand new 18 or 20 French G tube right in their stomach. We do the procedure under sedation, so we use nurses. These nurses are well trained, they've got training in ICU, um, they're smart, they work with us. We we are basically prescribing the sedation medicines and the patient gets sedated <clears throat> and then with the use of imaging guidance they get a very safely placed g-tube not surgical but a radiologically placed g-tube in about 15 20 minutes and then they're out the door and they can use that tube in 24 hours um IR is like walmart you know walmart's a good thing that's a good thing Walmart gives you everything you need in one place and a low price. Well, IR gives you that too. IR gives you anything you need. If you need, if you need arterial work, great. If you need venous work, great. But if you also need biliary work, right? If you also need, you know, cancer work, cancer treatments. If you need non-surgical cancer treatments. If you need gastrostomy, nephrostomy, pretty much any procedural work you can think of. If you need an LP at a at a bad time of night. Even though I hate doing those, to be honest, I really hate doing those. But darn it, if, if you if you force me to do it, I would I would have to do it, right? Pretty much, we can't say no to anything. We have to do it all. We do it all, and we prov provide you that value that you're looking for. And we do it, I think, in less time. I think we do it with less resources. I think we do it, creating higher levels of physician work RVU. And maybe that's an opinion, but I think if you do the research on that. You might be able to prove that's a fact. That's all I got to say. It's wrong on it.